Hello everybody and welcome back to Forza Horizon 4 and today I have a new video idea that I have not seen on YouTube before and it is the wheel spin challenge so I've got a super wheel spin and whatever car I get out of the super wheel spin is what I have to race in the Goliath so the Goliath's about a 15 minute lap um, on the hardest difficulty of course um, but whatever car we do get we are going to modify it so, this is our super wheel spin. What do we get? Oh, the Porsche! We were so close to getting the Porsche, but we got the Audi RS4, which I thought was a bit of a stinker at the start. I'm voicing, I'm doing a voice over this, um, and I just did that wheel spin. And 180,000 credits, so that's good. So we did get the Audi RS4, which we are going to find in our garage now. Uh, it's a new car that I've never had before. And yeah, so guys, what we're allowed to do is we're allowed to modify it. Just because it will be a bit quicker and more fun. So it is almost an A-class, so it's pretty decent already. Very good launch on it, which is what you want. And here it is, the beast. It doesn't look too bad, to be fair. I reckon you could get a decent modification on this. So I'm going to go and drive to the festival now to get some handling with this car. And I'll be catching you guys when I find a modification kit for it. And I had to pull out a drift. It's actually not bad at drifting. So here we are. We're just going to choose one of the, the best ones. I'm really fussy with this. Um, so we're going to choose one that's already tuned and all modified and all that. So we're going to go for the best one, the Max S2. With S2, you think that's pretty bloody good. So here we are now. 105,000 credits. And there we go. So I'm just speeding this up for you guys. <laughs> as I'm really picky choosing for my paint job. But then I realised, oh, it doesn't really matter. So I'll just get a white one, because why not? And the car looks sick. It actually looks really good. I think I might have got a bit lucky on this. Look at this. Look at the drift. It's not a drift race, but look at that. It's awesome. Looks like something from cars. Some good speed on it as well. But anyway, guys, I'm going to head over to the race, and I'll catch you guys there. And here we are. It's the Retro Saloons. One lap of the Goliath in our new car, which does look quite cool. It, I, I, <laughs> I think it won't be the last time I'm using this car. And we do start off crashing into someone. I'm not the best driver, guys, okay? I'm really bad, but <laughs> we're going to try here and see if we can work our way up to first place. Uh, the bit of the start of the Goliath is always the hardest because it's all windy and through the little village. But I will be showing you guys the whole race, but I will be speeding up most of it because it's just long. But I'll tell you what guys, we're in third place already. It's the launch in this thing, it bloody goes. It goes so fast. I haven't raced the Goliath that much. I did have quite a break from this game since the last video. Uh, trying to get top 1% in the world and drifting. And I think that put me off the game for a little bit. Because <laughs> that was the hardest challenge ever. But I'm going to let you guys watch this as we take over in first place. And I'll catch you guys in a bit.
So here we are guys, about halfway through the race and we've managed to keep up first and we've just gone past a lighthouse so we're on the beach now. It's uh, quite easy this beach bit until it gets back into where the busy festival is. But yes, like I said guys, we've kept our first place. This car is really good, the handling's good, all the modifications, it goes around corners nice, it's fast. Um, yeah, I think we've got pretty lucky with this challenge so far. Uh, but I do believe that the other contestants are quite close behind us, so I'm really concentrating. <laughs> Just trying to get ahead, trying to take everything perfect. And we did have a few crashes, but nevertheless, we're still first as we're speeding past these corners. But anyway guys, I'm going to speed it up again and get back to you near the finish line. Okay guys, here we are, we're near the finish line, I'm pulling out some drifts, I'm having fun. Um, but what I didn't realise is they were really close behind me, as I was just drifting around these corners. But, I think we've got the win, let's finish it in style. Look at that, first place, wow, that was amazing. And the others weren't too far behind, only two seconds, that's second place. They did rubber band me at the end probably, but then I was doing drifts, but never mind. But we came first place, the Stig came first place with the SPEED in the Audi. And we got 60,000, 24,000 influence, a wheel spin, we leveled up. Uh, here's our wheel spin. Oh, 60,000 credits! I'll tell you what guys, you can't go wrong. I have got very lucky with credits after I bought the 15 million Bamborough Castle. Oh, Edinburgh Castle, that's the one. And here we are guys, this is a car that won us the challenge. So if you haven't picked up this car really, I recommend it. <laughs> it is a great car and I really loved racing in it. So anyway guys, I think that ends it off for this video. Um, thank you very much for like, for, thank you very much for watching. Um, if you are new, please like and subscribe and let me know if you want me to do this again. Take care guys and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.